Hello, my name is Helen Playford. I'm Australian arts professional and executive member of the Cruise Lecturers Association. My lecture series are about my life as a travelling and exhibiting artist and the fabulous lives, loves and passions of four famous artists. Firstly, we introduce Claude Monet, a French artist and a family man with a tragic loss in his life. His obsession was with the beautiful water lilies and his famous garden studio. These paintings were the main focus during the last 30 years of his life. Many of these paintings were painted while Monet suffered from cataracts. Secondly, we introduce Henry Toulouse-Lautrec, who was a French aristocrat and the last in a line of a family that dated back 1,000 years. Henry's father was rich, handsome and eccentric. His mother was overly devoted to Henry, who was weak and often sick. Henry lived wholly for his art. He partied and stayed in the Montmartre section of Paris, the centre of the cabaret, entertainment and bohemian life that he loved to paint. Thirdly, we introduce the wonderful William Turner, an English painter who was known as the painter of light. His mother died young of a mental condition while his father encouraged his talents. Although his early paintings were often described as crude blotches, William Turner exhibited his first oil painting at the Academy in 1796, and it was a moonlit scene off the needles in the Isle of Wight. The image of boats in peril contrasted with the cold light of the moon, with the firelight glow of the fishermen's lanterns. Fourthly, we introduce Georgia O'Keeffe, a New York-based artist who was very controversial with her erotic-looking flower paintings. She also lived as a recluse in Mexico in later life. Georgia made large format paintings of enlarged blossoms. The forms were very suggestive and sensual. During this period, she also painted New York buildings. Drawing and painting was always a passion and has given me a life of adventure and appreciation. My studies include a degree in arts and a master's in business. My travelling life as an artist has included exhibitions in New York, Hong Kong, Singapore, Australia and beautiful England. The latest series of Magic Waters features landscapes of the Pilbara Desert region of Western Australia. If you like climbing and are fit and lucky enough to have a cool day, it's all breathtaking. Millions of years of formations is reflected in the landscape. And after climbing down a ladder, you can then walk deep into the gorge. For the last 10 years, I have spent six months in England and six months in Perth, Western Australia. In theory, we have a summer all year. My life in Hampshire is spent either painting or visiting the seaside or the new forest. It is always the lives and the struggles of other people that interest us. The artist particularly has to continually prove their worth to contribute to our appreciation of the world around us. This is the journey that we will take while you are enjoying your holiday. Thank you. I look forward to meeting you.